Take a look at this. This is brand new at 11. Suspected criminals slam into a Sandy Springs police car during a chase. And tonight, five men involved are in custody. The group is reportedly responsible for a string of crime across our area. The police chase and crash happened around 2 this morning near Brandon Mill Road and Dally Ripple Road. CBS 46's Sierra Cummings is live tonight with why these arrests are significant. Sierra. Yeah, super significant. That chase started, as you mentioned, here in this area on Brandon Mill Road just after 2 o'clock in the morning when it's dark out. And just take a look. These are narrow, windy roads, so it could have been much worse, but thankfully there were no injuries. An officer patrolling the neighborhood on Brandon Mill Road spots a stolen car. Accident. The police lights come on as the officer tries to stop the car, but the driver instead turns around, speeds off, headed towards police, then hits the police car almost head on. They say these five people were all inside. The youngest, who is not pictured here, was a 17 year old. Along with them, two stolen handguns, ski masks, and tools officers say they've been using for auto crimes. I'm all right, I'm all right, I'm all right with this. I need four units now. I got, got one in custody. Sandy Springs police confirmed with CBS 46 the men are all suspects in ongoing car break ins at homes and in parking lots in the area. Investigators say it is one of the biggest problems across this community. Just last week, the department received this surveillance video. It shows a suspect in a parking lot walking car to car, checking to see if doors are unlocked. <laughs> Neighbors reported an uptick in car thefts, and it's why officers say they're glad there are now at least five fewer suspects roaming the streets. Am I, am I, am I with this? And two of those suspects already had warrants out, active warrants out for their arrests and other auto crimes. And remember, this started because of a stolen car. So police are using this as an opportunity to remind you, one, to lock your doors, but also never leave the valuables inside. Live in Sandy Springs, I'm Sierra Cummings, CBS 46 News. Sierra